again and welcome to Vlogtober Day 8. Well today it's very miserable out there. It's been raining here since yesterday evening. Finally stopped at 9 o'clock. Um, I did check the forecast on my phone just to see what the, the day was going to bring and it said the rain would stop at 9 this morning and then we'd have a cloudy day and the sun would appear about 4 o'clock this afternoon. Yeah, I think we might get a little bit of cloudy sun to start with, but then the sun will come out. <laughs> then that'll be it. But oh, no, it's so miserable out there today. So miserable. As you'll have seen from the little clips I put in on my walk to work this morning. Anyhow, I'm having a few minutes break. I've just packed up a few internet orders. Um, so I am having a mocha coffee. I like these mocha coffees. And um, I just thought I would share some progress on my knitting. I've still got it in my nice little autumn bag. I actually managed to get some done last night. The kittens had to keep going into time out in their pen last night. They were so mischievous. <laughs> they were little devils. Oh, so yes. Bramble's the worst, I think, really. She's a monkey. So, yes, we have to put, of course, every time you put them in the pen, they think it's time to go to sleep. <laughs> so, we got a bit of peace and quiet. But no, they were up till quite late last night. So, I managed to get a bit of knitting done because I've got a bad knee and I decided to spend the evening sort of put my knee up and rest it a bit, which did help. So, Kevin was running around after all that, a little bit more last night. <laughs> We still had one or two little accidents. Trouble is, we've blocked off round the TV so they can't get in, but you can guarantee they always find a way. And of course, by the time Kevin's got up off the settee, across the room, moved some of the stuff to get in, she's done her business, hasn't she? <laughs> so we've got to rethink things a bit today when I get back home. So. <laughs> So I'll show you this guys a fun day. Anyhow, right, I'll show you my socks. So last night I managed to get the gusset done. Now I don't know, I've made I have made a bit of a move because the green should have been in here. And I think because I put I had I did the heel in green. I thought it would be okay. I mean, it's okay. It's okay. I don't think it matters that much. And I don't, you know. But I, I know it's. I know I've gone wrong. But you know, it, it doesn't matter. It doesn't spoil the socks or anything. I just never really thought. I just thought there'd be too much green with the heel. But no, I think it would have been fine. It would have been a lot better. Never mind, we learn, don't we? So you never know, the next sock I might continue with the green. It doesn't matter if they're different, I don't care about that. It's all just practice and learning, isn't it? So, But yeah, I love these colours, absolutely love them. So I have done, what have I done? I think I've done a couple of rounds on the foot. I just thought last night, you know, I was determined to get this gusset done. So hopefully I'll get a little bit more done today. And yeah, well, I, I'd like, I mean, normally I'd say I'll have these done by the weekend, but you know, having kittens, no, there's no chance. <laughs> I just take opportunity as and when I can. This is why I brought it down to work today. Because uh, I thought I might sort of get time to do a couple of rounds a little bit later on in between jobs. I've got lots of jobs to do today. Um, so I thought, no, I'll take my knitting. Even if I, I can only get a couple of rounds done, it all just adds to the total, doesn't it? So, yeah. Um, I haven't brought my computer down today. I thought I'll leave it at home because, obviously, carrying that down, and I've got a bad knee, it's not good. And I thought, well, today, if I photograph things, because I've got some... Uh, Christmas fabric sat there waiting to actually go online. I think there must be about 10, 10 bolts of fabric there and I've not had a chance to photograph them. So that is the job for today is photographing things. And then 
I can probably get some online tonight if I'm lucky. I mean, I don't know if I'll do that. It'll probably be tomorrow. Because as tomorrow's Friday, it's normally a work from home day for me. But I have got to come down to the shop because there's a delivery coming. And it's more fabric. <laughs> don't know where it's going to go. But it's fabric that I'm owed. Because obviously things are still slow at getting deliveries. But there is a bolt of Halloween fabric coming in. And... Yeah, I can't remember. I know I ordered a bolt of Halloween fabric because I remember when I saw the rep a few weeks ago, I said to him, well, I hope it's not going to be too long. Why is it going to be too late? So, and I can't remember what design it was. <laughs> Never mind, it'll be a nice surprise tomorrow. So, yeah, so it is it is going to be about sort of photographing and putting things on the website because I am just trying to get as much on the website as I possibly can now. Because I need to really. I'm hopefully as well going to cut out <clears throat> a few bags today. Because <clears throat> I'd like to use some of the new Batik fabric because oh, it's, just, it's just so stunning. Um, so I'd like to do something with that. Even if I just get them cut out today and they're ready for sewing over the weekend, I'm fine with that. I need to make a little list. So I think I might do that now <clears throat> while I have my coffee. So I'll catch you a little bit later on. my afternoon photographing fabrics to go online um, some of the new Christmas fabrics and then I've been cutting out bits of fabric for some new bags so I will show you what patterns I've picked well this is the new Victorian one and for the lining I've got the stripe and then for the drawstring channel I'm using that so it all sort of coordinates then I've got um, the solar system and that's for the channel and for the inner I've got a nice blue and I'm going to do this fun one as well this pen the penguin <laughs> this um, flamingo and I found a sort of a salmony pink to go with this on the um, flamingo and I've got blue for the channel which picks this out so I'm going to back down to the shop tomorrow so I will probably start cutting out then I've just thought I'd just pull some colours together really and get them make a start so, so well, I'll see you a bit later on <laughs> I'm home from work now and I'm just enjoying a nice cup of tea in my Norbert mug and I thought I'd pop on now and I thought I'd show you the well I'll update you sort of on my sock now the the foot's coming on okay I managed to get from the the green oh gosh where are we the green down into the third well I did that colour and I'm on the orange so I did manage to get some done today, which was good. I think I might try and set myself uh, a little bit of time to knit on my socks during the day if I can. Uh, yeah, so I'm really pleased with them. Coming on nicely, so I'm hoping I can get a little bit done tonight. Um, I've got a few plans today, well this evening, what to do. Um, but you know what it's like. <laughs> Kittens and time, it's you know, it doesn't go together. <laughs> Anyhow, I got some uh, happy posts today, so I've been spending. 
Now, um, one of my viewers, I'm sure it's called so, so if it is so, hello, and if I've got your name wrong, I do apologise, but she sent me a link to um, somebody who was selling yarn that's sort of the colour that I was asking for. Now that's the the colour, you've got purples and greens and black in there, which is what I wanted. I, I did want some orange in, but I'm not bothered about that because I'm hoping that I've got a, a ball of orange. I've got to have something in my stash and I thought I would do maybe cuffs and toes in orange. And on Instagram, she is The Lonely Knitter. And her website is craftersbalm.co.uk. So that is her card. Now I hope this comes out the right way around because to me it's back to front. But I will I will try and remember to pop the links down below. But this is absolutely gorgeous and it is called This is Halloween and it's 100 gram four ply fingering, 75% superwash merino. 25% nylon and there's 400 meters but it looks gorgeous love the colors so i cannot wait to make a start on these but i really must finish my other my socks off there <laughs> oh dear me i don't know anyhow i just want to say a big thank you to everyone who's been leaving comments on the week oh, the weekly the daily vlogs and on the podcast and thank you as well to everybody who's been leaving name suggestions for uh, my autumn tonte well every name that's been suggested i love, love it even adele does and it's been really hard to decide what to call him so i think what we've de decided is we're going to call him Oakley because I think that's really, really good. Because he's got he's got oak leaves on on his on his hat. So yes. So say hello to Oakley. <laughs> so at the minute he's he's been standing in private place on my mantle with the pumpkins and the pumpkin candles. So yeah. So he's gorgeous. Absolutely love him. And I, I love the little pumpkin that's there as well. But like I say, every name that came up, it's like, oh yes, that's a good one, I like that one. And we've had quite a few, well, every name was really good, really good suggestion. And it was really difficult to, to choose which one we like. But um, with Adele's help, yeah, we've picked Oakley, so that's fantastic. Uh, not really, I'm, well, I say I'm not sure what I'm doing tonight. I mean, I have got a little bit of housework to do tonight. Um, so I'm probably going to call it a day for the, with the vlog today because I have got a little bit of secret sewing to do, which I can't share with you just yet. So I need to sort of have a little bit of time to do with that. Um, but I just want to say thank you for joining me today. It's been lovely having your company and I hope you've all had a good day and you've managed to get some crafting done and uh, have a lovely evening everyone and I will see you all again tomorrow. So bye for now and take care. <laughs>